Have you ever wondered what a time capsule from 60 years ago would look like? Well, I've got a pretty good guess now that we're at this auction in Redfern. We're at a house that's been styled either very intricately or it's been left exactly as is. I think it's the latter. This box is so old, it might even have the secret recipe inside it. Did you know, iPhones used to look really different. There's in-flight magazines from the 50s. There's all sorts of memorabilia around here. I wonder what will happen to it all. For one family, it's a very big day. Carmen remembers growing up here and a close connection to her dad, who owned this home for 60 years. A lot of memories. Good memories? <laughs> yeah, very good. It's an unusual property for a number of reasons. It bears the marks of its age, including an old Dunny Lane, where the outdoor loo was a very long walk from the house. 810, you've played it well, you've played it better, I know. So congratulations and well done. So um, why did you decide to step in, in for your daughter? What makes you think that that's... Yeah, because if we don't have them, there's no way they're going to buy a house, isn't it? Yeah. And that's what we do, baby boomers. We help our children all the way, right? <laughs> so my historical trip continues throughout this house in a kitchen that has definitely seen better days. Nonetheless, it is a hipster paradise. And we're in hipster heartland in inner city Sydney. What would they make of this?